This is the Inventor Show. I'm totally against it. Forming my own opinion, I don't agree. Actually, I'm against the first level interaction with the, as a customer service at banks due to the difficulties. I'm totally against robots to work as a customer service because I'm, I'm working as a customer service and I'm, uh, I notice that customers like to have empathy with them. When they want to talk and, cho uh, and ask about details things, especially old people, the, like above 60, they, they need some uh, help, like small details that I, I have to tell them that they have to sign on all the agreements. They have to read. The robot will do, not do this to them. I am with a robot because you don't have to pay monthly salary for them. Well, I'm totally against um, robot taking over human jobs. In the most, we live in an advanced time where there is rapid technological involvement, but um, for robots to be at the customer service is um, not good because machines are set automatically and human beings interact and uh, questions pop up in which the machines will not be that efficient to answer some questions. And most especially for robots to take over human jobs, there will be lots of unemployment around the economy. And that will bring about starvation, economic hardship, depression, and a lot of things will happen. So for robots to take over human jobs, well, we, with the age at which we live, is good, but there will be a lot of disadvantage than the advantage. Of course, we prefer the human interaction, especially as a first level together with the customers, okay? Uh, for the, the other services or the back end, the robotics might take over in a certain level, but for the time being, we prefer the human interaction. Even if, if the robots will take our jobs, then what we will work, especially in customer service, there is a, all, in, in all firms, we have customer service. If the, if the robots will take this job, so it will be a big uh, uh, gap. I'm not vote to that if robots will serve as a customer customer service, right? Because for me, it's more important that you really have a personal in touch with customers, especially in customer service. And especially if the robots will take the vacancies of customer service, the rate of uh, unemployment will be raised in Bahrain. Shayma Almir, a Bahraini girl who was able to win the title of Bahraini Technology Pioneer despite her young age. My name is Shema Almir. Uh, I've recently graduated from Bahrain Polytechnic uh, from the major of Information and Communication Technology, and I recently work at the National Space Science Agency. When I first started with BISB, I was here for an internship from the university, and I had the privilege of working on a robotics project. Um, the project that I have developed basically acts as a customer service where it answers to, co to customers' inquiries about the bank rather than waiting for a long queue and then um, uh, getting an answer from an employee. My name is Sandit, a smart and lovely robot. I believe that people can benefit from the robot uh, because if, uh, if you have a look into, the, uh, to, into other countries, you'll notice that people actually use robotics in airports in schools, in insurance companies, and even in hospitals.
terms of obstacles, uh, my major obstacle was that there was no courses in Bahrain regarding robotics, how to build robots or how to even uh, program robots. So um, even in my university, I was not taught how to program a robot and the languages that I have been using in order to develop the end product. Therefore, uh, to overcome the following obstacles, I had to research uh, on my own, study courses and uh, speak to people from outside the kingdom uh, that will help me to um, develop the end result. After this robot, um, I'm willing to look into the adva more advanced robots and try to um, program them and learn how, how they're being built so I can even produce more robotics in different fields in Bahrain. Uh, robotics is a very interesting field, I believe, and um, even though you might find several obstacles while trying to um, create one, but at the end of the day, when you create it, you just feel satisfied, and um, I'd suggest everyone uh, to try to work with the robotics and the recent technologies that we have been seeing. Advanced programming launched in an innovative way to directly serve the community through which Shayma was able to compete with the world's youth and raise the flag of the Kingdom of Bahrain. Thank you for watching and thank you Bahrain International.